We were trying to do, figure out that, um, you know, one of the things ACTUP did all the time was use this metronome of how many AIDS deaths that there were, you know, one AIDS death every half hour, that idea, you know, um, And we were trying to figure out about the idea of um, around young gay men, actually, around the idea of zero conversion, because there's been such a sort of wave of, you know, all these years later, the numbers are not reduced in the way that you'd expect them to actually have been reduced based on all the, the amount of education the rest of it has gone on. So that thing is a striking thing. And, and you know, all the, the epidemic of methamphetamine and all the issues that happen in a lot of the urban gay communities around um, prevention, education, and zero conversion were so complicated. Still, these issues are really thorny in terms of um, drug treatments that are now being proposed. The morning after drug treatments are now being proposed, complicated things further in terms of where we're going. Mm -hmm. I, think it's, it, I think that we'll, we'll, we'll see the rises. I mean, you know, all, all I need to say is uh, Rick Santoro. I, you know, <laughs> you know, it, it, I mean, that is, you know, that will certainly generate, uh, that actually should quite generate a response. <laughs> we'll be back. 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 We'll be and it's and actually what what I find fascinating is now the opportunities arise. I mean, it really is a, a different time in terms of the technology. I mean, we did you know this work with mechanicals, you know. They don't know. I know. With, I know. Wow. Electricity, you know, electricity, you know, like setting the setting the every letter down by hand, okay, and measuring it so that each one has the correct space. This is all the stuff we did by hand. You know, sort of, it's, it's, you know, if you will, sort of a, it's a buggy as opposed to, you know, a, a hybrid car now. So um, I think that if anything, it's a great time to be able to produce that kind of work and disseminate it. Because now we have, you know, before we did work that was very limited. If you walked in front of the poster, you saw it. If you didn't, you know, <laughs> you didn't. <laughs> Now, we I mean, could work fax is created. It to you. Yeah, we can fax it to you. <laughs> so, but now, I mean, work can be created that people can, you know, get that gets disseminated instantly and goes around the world. I mean, you know, I, I've seen images that you know someone sends me, and then someone sends me like three days later from another country. So, I think the opportunity for that kind of sort of activist work is huge now, and you know, I encourage people to uh, visit. Take the next step. Right. I think I'm surprised. Um, I would say, though, uh, I have to comment on your question. Uh, of the posters that we, uh, well, we did a couple of them, but we chose to do the four questions poster very consciously because we were aware that without uh, adaptation of the text, it's the only thing that we did that still is actually true the way it's, it's written. Uh, the Welcome to America, Welcome to America Welcome to was the other one, well, but no, except when the caveat that uh, South, South Africa, Africa now has national <laughs> health care. Yeah, exactly. So, VR. so <laughs> I, think it's, I think it's worth commenting that uh, not only did we do that poster, the four questions, it actually was the first exercise we suggested to the workshop that we're doing with MRE students. And the responses were very interesting to the idea of them we based in that poster. And the other thing that I would say to circle back is that the, the eye test, while it's true it was thuddingly dull and impossible to read, it's also completely 100% true. The, the, we've just now named the ways in which nothing has changed. And it is the broad stroke that actually is the problem. And we're positioned constantly to think that things are take, being taken care of or things are going to be okay. We fall into that trap. It's a, a human thing. It's a personal thing. But it's also institutionally set up so that we will begin to think, well, you know, the medical community is doing everything they can or the pharmaceutical companies, they're not really in it just for profit and everything's going to be okay. And look, here's something that seems like a cure. So let's start having unsafe sex again. The fact is that that eye test was actually true, what we were asking for. Impossible, but true. And that, though the things in that poster are the things that activists for generations, for decades in America have been fighting against. And there's, they're all still true, so the, the battle's still there. And 
I think in a way, in, it's one thing for us to say that we lost our voice because the issues became so complex we couldn't reduce them into slogans, but the truth is the issues were always complex. I think in a way, as a collective, we became aware that we became more and more aware of the complexity. That's, that's actually what happened. It, it didn't become more complex. We became aware of the complexity and couldn't figure out how to say it 